Hello, I am so excited for today's video. I'm actually Bridget from the future um, because as I was going over the footage of this whole video, I realized I didn't have a good intro or basically even explain what I was doing. So um, let me just explain. So a few months ago, I uploaded a video where I like redid my kitchen. I really loved how that video turned out. I loved how the kitchen turned out and I was just really inspired and wanted to do something else. Up to now, I have been filming my videos in our guest bedroom. Then I kind of just turned it into my film room slash office. That room was just really small. I only had like a small little section to film in because of the bed and everything in there. So I really, really have been wanting my own space to film in videos. But luckily we did kind of have like an extra room. The room I'm sitting in right now used to be our dining room and we had like this huge table in here. We'll get all into that later. But there was like a huge table in here, a safe in here, and just like a closet with a bunch of storage. When I say I never went to the dining room, we never do. We always eat dinner in the living room. This room basically just got pushed to the side and made for storage in a room to collect dust. I proposed the idea to my boyfriend a, co a couple months ago. I was like, hey, do you think it's possible that maybe I could turn our dining room into my, you know, like office filming room, maybe like a cute closet area? Side note, he actually wanted to make it into a gym before I proposed the idea of what I wanted to do. So he was a little like hesitant, but then he was like, yeah, that's fine. Cause I mean, I feel like an at-home gym is a little more expensive than what I did to this room. Anyways, just to sum it up, this was my dining room. I turned into my space. I don't know what to really call it. It's just a space for me to film and just be creative in. Not to spoil anything, but this is honestly my most favorite room I've ever had. You know, growing up, I never had my own room because I had a twin sister, so it's just awesome having my own space. I got to decorate it exactly how I want because, you know, this is my room. It's not a room I'm sharing with a boy. It's not my room I'm sharing with my sister. It's uh, my room and it's my own and I'm just so proud of how it came out. Um, if you like transformation videos, I hope you stick around stick around for the ride to see how this transformed. But um, yeah, I love this room and I hope you love it too. And without that being said, I guess we'll just get into the video of me transforming that monstrosity into what it is now. So um, yeah, I love you guys. Thank you so much for being here and uh, let's get on with the video. Okay, let me turn this stuff off. To keep a tight lip, you'll run the gossip tea. I look absolutely freaking terrible. I wanted to show you the absolute transparent before of this room. We never use this room ever. I walk in here like once every freaking five months. Literally, I never come in here. Hence all uh, the trash. <laughs> like, is this nasty? Am I exposing myself? <laughs> um, I don't think so. I'm just trying to be transparent and say like, hey, this is our like extra room that we throw our throw throw <laughs> throw all of our crap into and we just like have been putting it off putting it off and it's time to do something about it i'll walk you through everything i want to do in this room later but first things first we gotta clean okay this is like the big order of business we gotta clean this and like sell it because we literally have sat at this table less than five times <laughs> and we've had it for like two years lucas keeps his safe in here he's gonna move that into uh, his room eventually this used to be a bedroom but it was transformed into a dining room that's why like there's a doorway right here this is like the actual doorway where the door used to be but it's all open now because it's um a dining room and not a bedroom but that's why this is here and we've kind of turned this into like a little um chana area because when we moved in my grandparents and his mom gave us a bunch of like chana and it's been sitting here so we're gonna have to figure out what to do with that. I am gonna keep a lot like in boxes and storage. I'm out of breath already and I haven't even done anything. All right, I don't know how long this is gonna take, but I will catch up with you when I when it's done. Oh my gosh, look how freaking clean it is. I'll be honest, I can't even remember what day I cleaned this room. It's probably been almost a week now. There really wasn't anything else I could do until we moved this table out of here. Here in just a few minutes, someone is coming to get the table. I'm kind of sad because it was our first like dining room table and something that's been here since I've lived here, but it's okay. We we'll never use it and I got to like stop having uh, attachment issues to stuff. I honestly don't think this room is gonna be like that big of a project. I mean, it is gonna be a big project, but it's not gonna be as big as like the kitchen or like other rooms. So we gotta paint and put stuff in here. Oh, and we wanna we wanna change the light fixture because it's a nipple light. <laughs> and I don't want a nipple light in here. I want like a cute, a cute light. That's the, the update for now, and I will catch up with you uh, later. It's been a few days since the table was taken out of here. The agenda for today is we're gonna paint the walls white. I already have my drop cloth 
and the paint poured up. We're gonna use a little edger thing to go around all the edges, probably two or three times, and then we're gonna roll it on. I don't know what I'm gonna do with these things. Like, I, I feel grateful that our family like give us, this is probably like two or three years old at this point, but it's just not my style, you know? So I'm gonna um, donate it, I guess. But yeah, I gotta figure out where to put it for now at least. <laughs> off work he helped me do a couple things I couldn't necessarily do by myself like we put up the doors I'll show you that in just a second I finished painting the walls it's very echoey in here because there's like not furniture yet so let me just show you uh, what we have going on all the walls are painted white now oh, it's looking so much better can you believe that this used to be what it was I can't it's transforming okay. we have doors on the closet and the hold on let me close this and I actually had to paint these doors because we put the pretty side on the outside because that's like where the living room is. But we put the pretty side out there and I had to paint these white because it was brown, but I think it still looks fine. And then this one was an actual closet door. So everything is looking so good. I'm so excited. And then besides the blinds and the curtains, the only last thing we really need is a new light fixture because I'm not having the nipple. <laughs> I'm having it. I, oh, and the door. So the door, the light, and blinds and curtains. Everything else is gonna be just decorating it and putting stuff together. I'm gonna use this for like, you know, storage, putting stuff for videos in it. The reason we put closet doors here too, because this opening is kind of weird. Like it wasn't big enough for like um, two doors and it's too big for a regular door. So the sliding closet doors worked good and it was the cheapest alternative and I think they look fine. Like they don't even look that bad. Okay, now that I'm out of breath. <laughs> My intention with this room is I wanted it to be like an office, a walk-in closet, and like my filming room. I guess I can like walk you around the room and just show you what I'm gonna put where. So, let's walk in the door. And on this wall, I'm gonna put a big closet unit. Here, I'll insert the picture of the one I got. I'm gonna put it together tonight, hopefully. And then in the corner, I wanna put a mirror. This wall will have a mirror and the closet unit. Moving on. Over here, we still need to put the blinds and the curtain. I have an L-shaped desk that one side is going to be my vanity and then one side is going to be where I put my computer and edit. And that's the biggest things. Everything else I'm just gonna be decorating, hanging up stuff, putting lights and like fake plants. I'm out of breath because I have not talked this much in days. <laughs> I have a rug I'll probably put in the middle. I also have like a hanging chair. I might put that in here. I might put it in the corner over here. But anyways, that is the update for now. I'm so excited because I can finally See everything coming together. My plans for the rest of the night are to put together my closet unit and my hanging chair. So fingers crossed I can do that. It's about six o'clock now. Let's see what we can get done in like the next six hours.
now very very faded pink hair but it looks a little different um so much has happened i keep doing things in this room and i can't remember what i filmed what i haven't filmed so i got this new chair a little stool for the chair to show you too much of the room to like ruin the surprise we have a desk in here now i think i already showed you that i moved my computer in here i moved my makeup i have one last little haul i want to show you uh, of some things i've gotten for the room uh, literally from here on out the only thing we're waiting on is my new desk chair i'm using my gaming chair but for in here i ordered a beautiful like velvet pink desk chair so i hope it comes in soon i think it's supposed to be here in the next two three days i don't really want to show you too much but what you're sitting on right now is my desk i have an l-shaped desk and then this side right here is my computer and on this side of the l-shaped desk we're gonna have my makeup area so i got this really pretty uh round mirror for that area over here so yeah <laughs> I got this basket. This is something I was very, very excited about. Um, I got this really pretty, like, little thick woman figure. She's so cute. I'm like a thick girl, so I thought this was perfect to put in my room somewhere. A lamp. I'm not sure where I'm going to put this yet, but I just think at nighttime, the overhead light is way too bright, so I want to have you know this lamp we got to find a place for everything we're coming to an end this room has literally transformed so much in the last like two weeks i'm loving that chair by the way also since i saw you i put up two shelves there's that shelf right there by the door um, oh i didn't tell you i don't think but for this doorway you know we we're gonna put a door on this doorway but i'm thinking we're just gonna put like a little like hangy Thing. maybe one day I'll get a door to go there but it's just so hard to find a door that measurements I guess the next time you see me I'll be giving you a uh, tour of everything see you then I just hit myself in the face
styling reveal time. I am literally so in love with this room. So unfortunately, I don't have a camera person here today to help me like, you know, pan around the room and follow me around and me show you things. But I still, I'm going to give you an adequate tour of the room, okay? Let's just, let's just do it. I ended up putting this on the doorway instead of an actual door. It's so cute, a lot less expensive than a door. And I don't know. I mean, one day if I decide to, I'll put a door in this room. But for now, I think this is super cute. And it just kind of keeps it open. You know, it's not, it's not completely closed off. Okay, so we're walking in past the door here. And then right as you come in on this wall, you see this really pretty hanging shelf. And I love how this goes with this. And then this goes with that vibe. You know, it's just trying to match. Okay, and then we're coming into the room. And then when you're first met, with this beautiful view of my desk. On this side is my computer. This is where I'm gonna be editing videos and just, you know, online shopping, playing on my computer, all the cool stuff. Um, and then I have my makeup right here. I really love this organizer. I've had it for a long time. I think this is from TJ Maxx or something, but I had a lot of jewelry, right? So I got a jewelry holder and this is from Amazon. It just holds all of my jewelry. I think it's so cute. It spins as a look I'm in a store. I don't know, I, I love it. All my normal jewelry on this side but this side is fun to display <laughs> mirror and then i have this whole side to put my makeup on um, and then under here there is some little baskets that i put my hair stuff in this one has wipes makeup wipes scissors just miscellaneous stuff there are two little fake plants you know me queen of fake plants because i cannot keep a plant alive to save my life so this is just some fake eucalyptus in a pretty pink vase fake succulent then going up here we have this beautiful round mirror it's so big and i love how the vines just like overlace it <sighs> why am i out of breath <laughs> you know usually i'm not a gold person because it's like you know gold around but i love the gold mirror the vines are just so beautiful and this kind of gets lost in all these other vines but this is a fake hanging plant um i just thought it would go so good in the corner to kind of I don't know, I just thought it would go good in the corner. And then right here, I have some beautiful printed out pictures from Pinterest. And luckily, they turned out like really good quality. They're not fuzzy or anything. They look pretty HD. Um, you know, the Kermit instead of the Hermit. <laughs> Care Bears, Van Gogh, I think. Another tarot card, butterflies, beautiful. I literally love this hair. It's so comfy and soft. It's like a velvet feel. It's pink, goes under here perfectly. And yes, that is my new makeup and office area. Oh, and here's a little lamp that I use at night because that is just too bright to keep on at night. Cute. Okay, so heading over this way, look how freaking pretty this chair is. Let me move this out of the way. I don't know what it is about this chair, but something about having a roof when I'm sitting in it, it's so comfy. It just makes me feel homey. I put little lights on it. I don't know if you can tell, but yeah, there's little lights on it. And then I got this little footstool. It doesn't match perfectly with it, but I think it matches good enough. And I was, I love to sit and like prop my feet up. So perfect. And I could also use this footstool over there when I'm editing to prop my feet up. And just to tie everything in, I put a little bookshelf up there with books. This can kind of be like a little reading nook. I was gonna put more lights over here, but I don't really know where to put lights, like Christmas lights, you know? And then there is the closet that has closet doors on it. This has closet doors on it and it's not a closet, but hey, if it works, it works. I've been working on this room so much um, that the closet is for another day. I'm not gonna mess with it. Just, just believe me that it's kind of messy in there. And then we're turning back this way to my most favorite part of the room, which is my closet space, closet unit, my closet unit. Oh my gosh, look how freaking beautiful this is. I am obsessed, I am obsessed. This is where it comes in saying like, oh, it's my office, beauty room, filming room, and closet. So I guess I'll give you a little overview of the closet. So up on the top, I have, I didn't really mean for a pink theme to happen here, it just happened, but it's pretty cloth. These pink roses that are real, I need to add some more water to them, but they are so pretty. I love fresh flowers, especially since it's springtime, I wanna keep fresh flowers. Well, you know, they're fresh. They just like liven up a room. And then this candle, because we all know Bath & Body Works candles are very expensive, but they're super nice. I love them. I've already burned this one a lot. I can't even tell if you can see in there, but I love coconut scented stuff. And this is one of my new favorites. I think it's a new scent in general. 
cute decor and then coming down here i just have my like normal purses i just thought it was cute to display them like that and then this gucci purse that is not real not a real gucci purse this is my favorite perfume ever it's called cloud by ariana grande and i love it that's like my third bottle gucci shoes that are not gucci and I haven't decided what I'm putting here yet. I just ordered a lot of sweatpants, so I'm probably gonna put my sweatpants right here. Um, but for now, it looks kind of naked, but you know, it's fine. Over here, have some shoes. I need some new shoes, those are kind of dirty, but it happens. And then I just folded all of my skirts. I think this is super cute. It looks like a store. When I worked at a clothing store, we fold the skirts like this. Well, not like this. This is kind of messy, but you know. Um, and then some jeans, shorts. And then, you know me, I love color coding. So white, cream, pink, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple, gray, black. I literally love it. I'm trying to act cool and not be out of breath. Um, and then I just have this beautiful mirror that I draped vines over it. Got some fuzzy socks. And then I have this area down here for my hair tools. Cause I like to sit in front of the mirror and do my hair and lotion so do you like it i am obsessed with my new room i know the vines are a little overkill in some places just the the style right now like everyone has vines in their room okay just because i'm 20 does not mean that i can't keep up with the freaking vibes okay and honestly i'm so lucky to have this huge um window right here because it, it brings in so much natural light and it just opens up the room so you know how i had a different chair before that one back there if you're wondering where i put it I put it out there. It's not hanging up right now because it rained yesterday and I didn't want it to get rained on, but um, yeah, it's out there and under my tree. So yeah, this is my room. I am so absolutely proud of it. There are literally an abundance of angles that I can, you know, record from. Like I could sit in the floor in front of my closet or I can sit over here like I did in the intro or I can sit over here in front of the mirror. I'm just super excited to be able to have a space to be creative and make videos and make better content and just be a good YouTuber because I'm, you know, I'm, I'm striving to be an actual YouTuber. I just want to be cool and vibey, okay, like everybody else. Side note, if you have cats, beware of buying something like this because Miss Cheeto is like literally using this as her personal playground. I think I've showed you pretty much everything. This room has transformed so much. I would love to hear your thoughts on it or what I can improve. I'm sure this isn't completely 100% done. I can always add stuff, take away stuff. I'm sure that this trend won't last forever. Anyways, I guess that's the video. I really hope you enjoyed it. I really hope you liked the outcome. I'm just geeking out over my new room. It's beautiful and it's everything in my Pinterest dreams that I made become a reality. So I guess my advice to you is if you have a room that you want to redo, do it because it has like boosted my happiness as of lately. I love you guys so, so much. Thank you so much for watching and until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Love you.